Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel, and we have, of course, um, a little bit of news and some more info on what's coming this year. Um, I get requests from time to time, people saying, so, you know, are we on track? Are we going to get Windows 11 moments the way that they designed and decided to? Um, until now, the moments have been released pretty much on schedule. So uh, this is a, a change from the Windows 10 era when moments were, well, not moments, but these updates that they wanted to push on us were uh, always late and they couldn't just meet the schedule and they eventually changed to one big update a year and now it's quiet time. So on Windows 11, uh, of course, I've posted a video. Uh, Moment 3 is arriving by the end of this month and will be pushed to everybody uh, by mid-June. Uh, and of course, some of the features will be on, some are going to be off, and some are going to arrive later. And just like the other moments, some of us will see things later than others, and I don't know why. Once again, Microsoft wants to do it like that. Um, for this year, what's going to be left is Moment 4. Uh, so we are going to have one more update for Windows 11 22H2, and that will be Moment 4 arriving in the second half of 2023, probably around September or October. And it will also, at the same time, change something. Um, when you look at the Windows versions, uh, one of the things that you will see is that you're probably at 22H2. Uh, for the most part, still some people on 21H2, but as we'll get to the end of this year, you'll have to move on to at least 22H2 as uh, 21H2 will expire at some point. Um, this will bump up to 23H2. So this is going to be what we're going to see uh, with Windows 11 22H2. And Moment 4 is also going to take the time to bump up the uh, build number to 23H2. On Windows 10, don't expect that. Microsoft did say 22H2 is the last version, which means that 22H2 is going to stay 22H2 until the end. Uh, but 20, uh, but Windows 11 will move on to 23H2 with Moment 4 arriving later this year with, of course, some more new features and changes. Hopefully that some of them are going to be what people want to see in Windows 11. But uh, pretty much everything on track. So uh, this is going to be interesting. And... Of course, after that, we're going to focus probably to 2024, and that's going to be interesting because uh, there should be more moments, you know, moment five, moment six, and so on. But also, the mysterious Windows 12 will probably um, arrive later next year, so that's also something that we're going to be keeping an eye on and trying to see what's going to happen. Um, and uh, with the Microsoft Build Conference coming up, I think there's going to be some interesting hints of Windows 12 and the future of Windows in there. So that's going to be interesting to look at. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.